Hey YouTube, it's your girl, 19 Pyrex 20. Okay, so yes, I have a hat scarf on. Yes, my shirt is wrinkled. Cause I don't care. Long hair, don't care. Hair flip. Anywho, I'm just coming to y'all to show you that I was cooking. I know my channel is my single life vlogging. Well, not really vlogging, but you know, single life, dating one-on-one, outfits of the day makeup, and just kind of like me and what I like to do. I'm one thing for you single girls, guys, and everyone under the sun. My little piece of hair was hanging out. Mm -mm. Could be that ratchet. I love to cook. Okay? It is my passion. <sighs> I love it, love it, love it, love it. If I could do the leg kick for you, look out. Yeah, I'd do it, but I'm not going to show you. <laughs> but um, everyone's like, oh, you should go to culinary school. Like when I worked at my other job, he's like, you should be a chef. Anywho. I'm making tacos today, so let me show you my tacos. So, can I flip the camera? Probably not, but this is my taco meat. Ooh. And that's just some ground beef with some seasonings. And what you don't want to do when you season it, though, don't put salt because the packet, this, the taco seasoning has salt and stuff in it. So, what you do is you follow the directions. I do not, ooh, damn, wasted that good juice. I don't drain my meat. My sister in the background. But um, you season it like with salt or seasoned salt after. Because sometimes you can make it too salty. Um, that Then I made some cannellini beans and I put some carrot in it. Um, a little lemon. I didn't put any salt. It's a very sweet bean. It's a nice bean. Especially when you make like a nice bean dip. And there's a nice bean dip recipe by um, Becca. Oh, their bean dip is off the hook. But it's just this I'll show you. Can y'all see? So I just heated it up. Because I'm weird like that, I will eat beans. Even though it's not refried, it's the beans in the oven. Obviously, it's the taco shells. Then I made my own pico de gallo. I'll show you. Mmm, tasty, tasty. That basically is plum tomato with, I use white, on, well, I use Spanish onions. Um, and I like a lot of cilantro. And um, I gave my sister a hand, the Martin hand. And um, some onion, plum tomato, cilantro, a lemon juice, a little, I, I didn't have olive oil, which is key. So I didn't have enough, so I just used some regular vegetable oil. And then my salad. I got this salad, attitude, ow, the spinach, baby spinach. And then in the bowl, can you see in the bowl? So obviously that's feta, that's I shredded some carrot. Some plum tomato, because I didn't have like a lot of ingredients. Oh, my sink. It's not dirty, y'all. I'm going to clean now. Don't worry about that. We're going to get on this end. Cilantro. And then I put some onion. I wanted to do a boiled, boiled egg, but my sister said no. And basically, I'm going to wash my spinach and then mix it together. And honestly, guys, the best salad dressing ever, if you are trying to cut back, olive oil, lemon, cut up lemon, and salt and pepper. Honestly, that's it. That's all you need for a really great salad dressing. If you're not really into the lemony flavor, then you can use vinegar, any kind that you like. Anyway, I'm about to eat. I'll take a picture and I'll put it on my Instagram. Okay, bye. 